All right, here's a requested video on how to pull codes from your ECU. All right, here we have a stock single cam ECU. It's not mine. I can't do anything with it. This is strictly for just showing you how to read the codes. Dual cam ECU. I uh, just chipped for somebody who messaged me and they actually sent it to me. So got that done. I'll be mailed out tomorrow. You'll notice dual cam have a red light. Single cams have two. They read the same way. Uh, nothing's different. Now I'm going to teach you how to read as it flashes. You got to go into diagnostics mode. So when you on the ECU it says diagnosis mode change. So you rotate that little uh, twisty thing all the way clockwise. Now, what you do is you don't turn the car on. You simply turn the key to the on position and then watch it. It'll start flashing now. Obviously, I'm not in a car, but I did make um, an external power source. That's pretty much the ECU thinks it's in the car. So let's pull the codes and um, I'll teach you how to read them. These lights will flash as soon as I turn the power onto it, which will be just the same as you turning onto the on position. Now, slow flashes are the first number. As Then the next set, they'll flash fast. If it flashes twice slow and three times fast, that means 23. That would be code 23 is what you're throwing. So I'll turn the I'll flick the switch and let's have a look. One, two, one, two, three. All right, that's code twenty three. I don't have that information in front of me, nor do I remember that on the top of my head. Let's try it again. Ready? ECU's on. One, two. One, two, three. Code 23. Here comes another one. Four. I mean, it starts with a four. One, two, three, four, five. Code 44, code 45. Can't really watch it as I'm recording this, but you get the picture. It'll blink slowly for X amount of times. It's going to be the first digit. Then it'll flash fast. That'll be the second digit. It's very easy to read. Um, if you get code 55, which is five slow flashes, five fast flashes, that means the system is okay. There's nothing wrong with it. This could tell you from codes, knock sensors going bad, uh, EGR, anything that your car is throwing, it, you can read it from here instead of going to an auto zone or whatever and trying, hopefully. Some places do have a scan that'll scan um, pre-96 cars, some places don't, depends on where you live. This is very easy and it works for your 240s, your Maximas or Ultimas. Pre-96, this is the way to look at it. As you could tell, as I explained in a previous video, two chips, 16 bit, 16 bits, two 8-bit chips, single cam, one, bit chip so it's an 8-bit ECU a little bit more different to work with I can't touch it I promise I wouldn't um, user drifter 101 your ECU is coming tomorrow so hopefully you should have it a couple days well here's a requested video if you need anything else or have any questions let me know